What is your idea of the perfect potato? Washington farmers strive to grow what you want. They have yellow potatoes, purple potatoes, long potatoes, and of course, pretty potatoes. Almost all the potatoes you see here are varieties that haven't hit the consumer market yet. USDA geneticist Chuck Brown and his team at the research station in Prosser work to find new potato varieties. They study everything from potato disease and pests to things consumers care about like browning and bruising. They even look at potato varieties from long ago to help with developing the perfect potato. This is a, an Ozette potato. Uh, if you look at it closely, you'll see it has a lot of eyes, a lot more eyes than our modern potatoes. And then uh, eyebrows that are very pronounced. Um, you know, we'd never select something like this in a breeding program now. That's, uh, well, that's a, a sure thing. Most believe that the Ozette, or its ancestor, was the first potato grown in Washington and arrived with the Spaniards in the late 1700s as they made settlements around the Puget Sound. Although consumers have many more choices beyond the Ozette today, some of its traits are still being used in new varieties. It uh, has a long dormancy so you can keep it well without refrigeration. You just put it in a box somewhere. In your, in your house. And uh, I'd have to say that uh, the, you know, the fact that it has lasted so long, so, uh, more than 200 years since it was first introduced, says something for the hardiness of it. So another potato wouldn't have survived. In today's newer varieties, researchers try to find potatoes that are tougher against pests and diseases. But at the end of the day, what the consumer wants, the consumer gets, and high quality is the most important. One variety the team has been working on shows signs of success. Quality is very good. Um, it's good and when it's evaluated for a process market, in other words, sending to a factory and then made into french fries for the most part. Fresh market kind of potato you buy at the store and probably bake. Uh, it uh, stands out in that regard. These are just two of the many traits researchers try to improve upon with every new variety. Their quest is long and arduous as they try to give farmers and consumers perfect potatoes.